Hi, beauty. So it's the next day. I'm in my car somewhere in Brooklyn. I meant to start this at home, but of course it wouldn't be a jazz vlog if I wasn't running late. So today is Friday and I'm going to get my hair done. It's time for new weave, time for new look. And um, I finally wanted to go to the freaking Brooklyn Museum to see the um, Spike Lee exhibit. And I have an appointment for the PR showroom for Doors. Um, if you guys are not familiar with Doors, they sell a lot of independent designers. So they wanted to um, loan me some pieces and I want to show you guys. And then I feel like since I'm so late for my hair appointment, I shouldn't even be vlogging that I wanted to go into Century 21 again to see if they have some discount like shoes slash boots um, or whatever. Um, but yeah, so that's the plan for the day. Um, I'm not sure where we're going to end up because the hair appointment, I'm already late. So let's go change this hair. I feel like I wanted to go longer and just like more of Vixen vibe, but we'll see what happens today. So let's stay tuned. So while editing, editing, I realized I screwed up the whole entire intro of this video. So I wanted to say, let's rewind till yesterday. Um, I had the pleasure of going to a number seven skincare event. I'm um, featuring Elizabeth Banks. She just dropped a new skincare line. So I wanted to rewind to yesterday at that number seven event and then forward to today where I got my hair done. So hope that makes sense. Sorry. So here we go back to yesterday. number seven event it was actually really cool um it was with james i just realized i didn't know she produced the movie cool game bear i watched it on the plane to paris and it was so funny and like like horror kind yeah, of funny it, so it was cool um i'll update you guys tomorrow I'm going home waiting for the uber and we'll go tomorrow to get my hair done and on the fun journey that we have planned for tomorrow So now you know because I'm back in the car they say if you feel like crap get your hair done so I've been having an off week so I want to get my hair done and yes I feel much better but I'm loving it it's like giving like curtain bang kind of like 70s vibe I love it I'm obsessed so what are we about to do so now it's about one o'clock I was like I want to go to the Brooklyn exam Brooklyn exam the Brooklyn Museum because I wanted to see the Spike Lee exhibit that I told you guys about probably in the last two vlogs I'm in Brooklyn so I might as well go do that right so that makes sense I have to make it to doors by 3 30 um, and through doors is like in the Soho area so figure by the time I do that I can go see what's in the area shopping wise and then um, pretty much wrap up the vlog because I think that'll be it 
Will that be it? Yeah. So doors, Brooklyn Museum. So let's go to the Brooklyn Museum while we're in Brooklyn. You know, I put my lip on because I want to show, you know, this hair. I'm just loving it. So let's go. It's the perfect New York day. I need to show you what I was wearing, but I'm wearing my Paris, France uh, sweatshirt and my Fashion Nova Cargos with my fuzzy wuzzies. I love these. <laughs> you guys have to get these. They're so comfortable and actually wearable. So let's head to the Brooklyn Museum and possibly grab some lunch because I'm dehydrated and thirsty and all of the things. Um, but yeah, if you feel like crap, get your hair done, girl. Get your hair done. You will feel like a million bucks. Of course, um, my stylist information, I'll link it down below. Her name is Tamara. She's amazing. I was like, Tamara, how do I, how am I going to sleep with this? Like, what am I supposed to do? So she told me what to do and how to pin curl it. So I think I could do a good job of maintaining it, but I'm so excited about it. Now let's go to the museum. <laughs> got to see the Spike Lee exhibit which is amazing so if you live in New York and the Brooklyn area I don't know what's happening around me I feel like there's some type of protest kids are out of school and people are fighting but I'm on my way downtown I'm gonna just hop on the train since my car is here and it doesn't make sense to drive 30 minute train ride versus an hour car ride in traffic that I would still have to find parking but the exhibit was so inspiring just all the things that Spike Lee has done in the world just photography art film amazing so if you can't go see it go check it out music it was just it was really awesome and it was cool inspiring just to see it in all the different aspects that inspired him to create which is really cool so I don't know what's happening let me get on the train
So I pulled a few pieces that I'm gonna try. This is from the brand Akatir. I don't know how to say it. And this jacket from Jen, I mean dress from Jen Lee, which is like really, really cool. And this jacket from, there's a few pieces from this brand that I did like, no, no sense. I might pull this little doll thing off because <laughs> I don't think that's my vibe, but um, it's a cool place to come if you want to try independent designers or find a lot of independent designers. So let me see what I can borrow and try on that will work for me in this fitting room. So let's see. So this is the first brand, which is cool. I feel like once I have the right shoes and stuff, it'll be really cool and I can wear like my oversized like white leather jacket on top of it. And I can give a moment and bring this to life. Um, body's body. So that's the first brand. I definitely think I want to borrow this. So this is from the brand Jen Lee. It's really pretty. I'm not sure if you can see the true yellow. Um, but it fits really good. I could do it with like a booty, like leather jacket. And I like the colors. Um, it reminds me of a checkered dress that I saw from Vivian Westwood. I think it's really cool. Well, I got red lip. I gotta zip this on the side, but I do like this. This jacket's from the brand Essence, which is cool. It kind of reminds me of a vibe I like with my Charles and Keith like shoes. I don't know about this doll thing. I, <laughs> it's like not my vibe, but I do think it's cool. It'd probably be something that I wouldn't pick. I probably would just go with the other stuff. Preferably like that dress and like the set. I feel like I can make work a little bit better, even though this is cool, but. What do you guys think? Guys, I don't even know what to say about the last part of this vlog. So, I don't even know where I left off. I left off, I went to doors, I picked up the pieces that I was supposed to get. Couldn't even show you guys in Sephora because it was the first day of the sale, so you know it was a madhouse. Hold on, let me see if I can change the lighting. So you guys know it was a madhouse, right? So, I couldn't even lift my arm in there. I got a few things from there, nothing crazy. Couldn't even open the app because the app had crashed. <laughs> so I was like, all right, let me go to Zara. Zara was packed, I didn't really see much. I went to Koss, um, didn't really see much either. The things I'm gonna show you from Koss, I ordered online, which is really cute. Um, then I was like, all right, it's probably time to head back to Brooklyn to get to my car. So I walked to the train, so much walking to transfer the ACE, transfer to the two. Get to the two train, which should be like a 10 minute ride. The train is delayed 30 minutes. Mind you, at this point my feet hurt because I've just been walking all day. And then like, it's just like my feet are uncomfortable. So I'm sitting in the hot train station because all of a sudden today it was a, it was a summer day. And Soho, so I'm waiting for the train, but it doesn't come for 30 minutes. It wasn't 20, 30 minutes. Of course, by the time the train comes, it's packed. Packed, so packed like sausages. Like in there, like so tight, like you can't even see like what your stop is, you might miss your stop. The, it's an older train, so you can't see the stop either. So I think, I, I thought I missed my stop, so I run off the train, I'm off on the wrong stop. So now I'm not waiting 20 minutes for the next train. I get out, I am I go get a donut from Brooklyn Donut Delight on um, Flatbush, eat a donut, all of a sudden my Sephora bag rips, all my things on the floor, I'm like, what is going on? Get in the Uber. Now I'm at my car and I'm in Brooklyn on Eastern Parkway by the Brooklyn Museum and I have to go home to the Bronx so that's a 45 minute drive. Yeah. <laughs> so and then my camera just died but luckily I have a battery to replace that. So now I'm on the way home. I don't know if I'm going to end the vlog here. I want to show you guys some new things I got in but I don't even know. You know how the day is just so exhausting you don't even know. I just need to like get home and then see. If it's the end I'll see you guys <laughs> week if I pick up then I'll see you guys tomorrow but the hair is still late though the hair is still late <laughs> so I'm ending the vlog here I hope you guys enjoyed I'll save my little haul for the next video because I'm still waiting for some items to come in but I hope you enjoyed don't forget to like comment subscribe and until next time guys be safe and be well bye